Uh, first of all, I have come here to see how many people look like. You are all smiling. Smile is a good thing. That means you are healthy. I hope the morning continues. Well. <laughs> Professor P. A. Peter, Chair of Health India Laboratory. Uh, Dr. Kirti Singh, Chairperson of World Learning Research Foundation. And Terry Peter, Director of World Learning Research Foundation. My friend Dr. Bram Singh and all the farmers, teachers, and uh, this is yes. And we are delighted to participate in the inauguration of the third symposium, Noni Set 2008, organized by World Noni Research Foundation. My greetings to all the organizers and researchers. While going through the monograph prepared by Professor P. A. Peter, I came across an interesting observation that NOMI has the most powerful anti-accident properties. It protects our vital organs from deadly attack of three radicals. It is essential to generate sufficient database linking anti-accident properties of NOMI and the cure of particular disease of human system following scientific principles and report in scientific journals. Today, friends, I would like to talk on the topic Research Challenges in Noni. Noni's reputation for uses in folk medicine extends back to several centuries. However, no medical application has been scientifically verified so far. In China, Samoa, Japan, and some various parts of the tree, leaves, flowers, fruits, bark, roots, serve as tonics and contain fever to treat the eye skin problems, gum and throat problems, as well as constipation, stomach pain, or respiratory difficulties. In Malaysia, heated bony leaves applied to the chest are believed to relieve the coughs and various diseases. No fruit is taken in Indo Indo China, especially for asthma, uh, lumbo, and medicine. As for the external uses, unripe fruits can be found and then mixed with salt and applied to cut down broken bones. In Hawaii, ripe fruits are applied to draw uh, pus from the infected boil. The green fruit leaves and the root have traditionally been used to treat various types of cramps and irregularities. The root has also been used to treat urinary difficulties. Noni seed oil is abundant. The linoleic acid which has useful properties when applied topically on skin, for example, anti-inflammation and uh, moisture retention. The present research of World Noni Research Foundation has to take the lead from all these applications and carry out systematic scientific research for scientifically evaluation of noni products. The World Noni Research Foundation can adapt to genomic research for developing noni plantation with a design, a curative and nutritional molecules suitable for cultivation in marginal lands in many parts of the country and as a companion crop for biofuel plantation. This will be an important contribution World Learning Research Foundation for rural wellness and development. Health can be maintained and disease can be prevented. Though technologies are advancing, people are still falling sick. Health can cost to fall increasing and there is no way to reduce unless you introduce prevention. The best prevention is through Ayurveda because it is a very comprehensive system since based on natural medicine which is devoid of toxicity. It is indeed a challenge to Ayurveda. Hence the challenge is right before us. How Ayurveda can be used to prevent the diseases by understanding the disease pattern, its genetic formation, its DNA structure, 
vai carregando integrated research with a modern biotechnology procurements genetic research on medicinal and aromatic plant so that the appropriate medicinal formation can be evolved in the form of a drugs to prevent the major diseases from the childhood or from the mother's womb i would say that the researchers are coming here to undertake such an approach for noni so that noni products can be used for preventing the disease WNRF should standardize the cultivation procedures for noni plantation so that they can get international competitive noni product from their plantation. Now I would like to talk about such a research area since I am the list of researchers, scientists, businessmen and farmers. I would like to WNRF to concentrate on following research areas. Number one, develop the an internationally acceptable standard for noni composition certification of noni product as an approved food supplement by accrediting the agencies the approval of noni plant varieties which will have a high yield and also specific biomarkers against specific diseases such as diabetes cancer and hiv so that these molecules can be converted as a drug for specific diseases Development of appropriate agro technology for cultivation of noni in marginal land of hot humid climate without dilution of a sand. Fifth, development of post harvest technology such as wetting, handling, storage, extraction of the juice, and value addition to maximize the return to the farm. The next one, scientific validation of the claims of the noni users in India and abroad. to convert noni formulation as medically approved product for treatment of various diseases after going through systematic scientific trials the last one finding methods of using noni plantation as a companion crop with the eucalyptus coconut and other fruit bearing trees with these words i am happy to inaugurate the symposium of noni such 2018 My best wishes to all the members of the Moni family for success in their mission of developing a healthy India through intensive use of cost-effective Moni product. May God bless you all.